Welcome to Crumbs 13, the prayer edition. Please join us as we go into prayer, and uh, we just trust that you've come to this today um, with his purpose in mind, so receive what he has for you. Heavenly Father, I just praise you and I thank you that you're such an intentional Father. Lord, that nothing is missed by you, not a detail of our lives. Lord, how you prepare our hearts, how you prepare our minds, how you meet us right where we're at, Lord. I'm just completely in awe every time we come to you, Lord, and, and sit with you and talk with you, Lord, how you just work out details beyond our understanding, Lord. Father, I just want to praise you and thank you for um, every person who is listening right now. Father, as they join in prayer, Lord, the circumstances of their lives that feel um, heavy or burdensome or oppressive, Father, I just pray right now in Jesus' name that they would see your truth, that they would um, acknowledge your hand, that they would that they would take your hand and walk with you through it. Father, as they navigate the hard terrain, Lord, that they would they could trust you in it, that they could trust that you are cultivating something new in them, that you are that you are moving in and through them for a better purpose, Lord. Your will be done in them, I pray. And Lord, I agree in Jesus' name with everything that Belinda spoke. And I just thank you, Father, for just the truth of your word that you are working all things out for the whole purpose, Lord. And so, Father, I ask that you would just help each one of us today to not be so focused on each single event that we miss the fullness of what you're trying to do through our life, to not be so discouraged by the things that don't go our way or um, the things that don't go as planned, Lord, that we miss the fullness of what you're trying to do to refine us, Lord. Father, the hard things are meant to purify us and to bring us into closer relationship with you, Father. So help us, Lord, just to have um, the whole picture in mind, Lord, and not to be so consumed by the day-to-day, -day, Lord. And Father, I just ask for just a new level of holy discipline over each person listening to this, mm -hmm. Lord, that they would have a hunger, a craving for you, Lord, that they would wake up in the morning and desire that you would be the first person that they would talk to, that you would be the first person that they get to know better, Lord, that it would be you, Father, that they seek first and foremost in their life. And Father, I thank you that those that are seeking you with their whole heart, that you call them the saints, Lord, that you will call them the ones that are called, Lord, the ones that are that are just seeking your face with intentionality, Lord. I thank you for that. And I thank you for the barriers that are being broken right now um, yes, in their in life name. and around their heart. In Jesus' name, I thank you that those, those walls are crumbling right now in Jesus' name. And we just pray a blessing over each person, no matter what time of day or day they're listening to this, that they would just be blessed by your Holy Spirit's yes. presence. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I am just trusting that the Father has met you. Um, he wants to do something new. And um, it's amazing how if you just release and let him, he can do it. Yep. We definitely we are, are a testimony to yeah, that. <laughs> we're experiencing it. Yeah. Yeah. So. Every day. Yeah. So thank yeah. you for joining us today. Yeah. God bless you. We can't wait to meet you at his table. <laughs>